So in this step, you set up your affiliate campaigns and these are the offers that you're promoting or the pages that you're trying to send traffic to. So let's choose a lead gen campaign and it will be tracking to, to lead gen. And remember, all these names and uh, campaign names and stuff are all internal to you and no one else is going to see this. So make them as descriptive as you want. They'll all be hidden from outside viewers. The next step is to choose whether you want to rotate your URLs or not. And this lets you split test with multiple URLs or just send traffic to one page. The affiliate URL, this is where you plug in your affiliate link or the page that you're sending traffic to. So for example, if you're, we're going to send traffic to our home page here, so it's going to be back into a two.com, and then you'd enter in your tokens. For example, um, if we had a sub ID, um, we just put in the sub ID token, and this value is generated automatically by the software. You don't have to add anything else onto this, and if you actually add in your own special information here, you would actually mess up the tracking um, and we will not be able to check your conversion. So make sure that for sub IDs, especially for affiliate campaigns, you don't put anything else in here. Um, I have a full separate video on just the sub ID and token portion. So if you need any more information on how that works, make sure you watch that video as well. We'll just go with what we have here now and then we'll put in the payout and this is how much you earn per conversion and then for cloaking you can either turn it on or leave it off by default remember that when you turn on cloaking it uh, tries to um, hide the refer of the traffic and this kind of protects you from having your campaigns stolen but the other thing though is that Cloaked links take multiple times longer to redirect than non-cloaked links. And if you're running campaigns, especially with mobile, you want to ensure that people end up um, on your links as fast as possible and you'll actually notice improved conversion rates by speeding up redirects and not having cloaking on. Once that's done, all you have to do now is hit add and the campaign that we just created, tracking to a two lead gen with a payout of $20, is uh, right here. The link URL is, when you click it, it will take you to the page that you entered in over here. You can edit, and it will bring up all the information for you to modify stuff, like let's say that the pay payout went higher. You can plug in this, and hit edit, it will save that information. You can also delete this link and to remove it from your campaigns. Just remember that if you remove a link and you're running traffic to it, you're going to have errors. All right, and that's it for the campaign setup portion of things. If um, you need more information on how to format affiliate links and how these tokens work, make sure to watch our video on that topic.